What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. So yet again I'm going to be hopping on Yukon Valley and today I decided to go after some caribou and I'm only going to be using the 44 so this should make the hunt interesting. Now I already set the time for 5 o'clock although the drinking time for the caribou do start at 4 but I don't like really hunting at night. And seeing the fact that I set it for five, some of the caribou should already be in their zones. So I'm going to get back to you till I got eyes on a caribou. Now, not far from my tent, I did have a zone. I did send out a few calls, although I don't see a bull. So I think I'm just going to take down one anyways. I guess I'm going to walk right on top of us here. <gasps> oh. Not too sure about the first shot, but the second shot was definitely vital. Oh, it already piled up. Oh, so yes, the first shot was stomach and intestines, and then I pulled off a double lung at 8 yards. So I decided to check out this open area, and I just spotted out two new zones. I got a level 4 there. 287 to 366 and then I got one straight ahead 230 to 309 now obviously I gotta move in closer I'm gonna see maybe for this guy I'm gonna try to get to here and see what my range is gonna be for him send out a call so I decided to go for this guy here. He's kind of got like an uneven rack. I did send out a few calls. I'm not too sure if he's actually able to walk right out here. I know usually when the tide is down, the water's not as deep. Actually, this may do if he gives me a broadside. Let's range in for zero and for 82 yards. and smoked them. So as you can see on the left corner on the bottom I don't know if you got a glimpse of that but uh, the water was kinda deep. Let's go ahead and claim them. So I did pull off a heart and right lung at 84 yards. I would say that's a pretty good shot. I happened to turn around and I got a glimpse of uh, another caribou. He's only a level 3. I just sent out a call. Let's send out another call to get him to come in. He's definitely taking the bait pretty good. About 93 yards. I think the... Oh, there's a moose. Not sure if I'm going to be able to pull off another heart. I prefer him being broadside. I don't know about this. I moved. That made contact. Not too sure if I did manage to pull off a vital shot. And let's go ahead and claim him. So even the fact that he did move, I still managed to connect with the left lung and then at 121 yards, I got him in the intestines. I just found a herd. Now, the biggest one that I found so far was level 3. I just sent out a few calls to get their attention to come in. This bull is definitely coming in. That looks like another bull in the back. I don't think that would be a level 4 anyways. This guy's definitely in range. Gonna wait till he stops again. Maybe go for the heart. Been doing good so far with the heart shots. As long as he don't move.
Whoa, what am I, what did I hit? I'm pretty sure the bullet actually connected onto the tree. So he's long gone. So I decided to check out another location and I actually just spotted out a new drinking zone, although there's only one. It's another level three. Now you can only zero in with the 44 to 82 yards, but I did make 122 shot on the intestine. So let's see if I can pull this off. I'm definitely gonna aim a little high. That did connect. His health is dropping. I definitely got him. Should pile up about there. Yeah, he just dropped. Now I decided to take cover because I do have some more caribou in the background. Alright. Oh wow. I even pulled off a double lung. And to be honest, there's all not that much bullet drop. It kind of almost centered out pretty nice at 124 yards. So this handgun's pretty good. I may have to test out the range limit, really. So, I do have a herd in the back here, although I don't see any bulls. That might be a bull there. Okay, it is a level 4, but I do have a level 4 closer, which is here. 100 yards out, so I can definitely make this kind of shot, but let's get his attention to turn him around. Now, I can't get well hidden in this tree, so better make this quick. I don't think the second shot connected. And I seem to have got him. His health is dropping. And here he is piled up. So the second shot did not connect, but I did pull off, busted through the shoulder blade and got the left lung at 93 yards. All right, so I found another level three caribou. Now I checked it out on the map. He's actually about 170 yards out. Now I'm definitely going to have to aim for the vertebrae, I'm pretty sure. Main contact. And his health is not dropping, so I'm going to say that was a no-go. It could have been the angle he was at as well. Well, one of the herd of caribou coming back in, and there's also a level 3 bull moose. It's about 140. He is nervous, so he definitely heard the gunshot before. Now, if he keeps on not heading, I may get a... Oh, no, he's alert. He's definitely going to take off. He's 128 out. Let's see, did I miss any good caribou? That's a question. I'm pretty sure he's going to take off, though. I'm, I stood back up, so... Oh, they're so bunched up together. There's a level 3. 130 out. Oh, there's a 4. Okay, actually, I'm going to move in closer for this guy. I want to get him down. Okay, I was not expecting to drop him. Coming in closer to claim him, I don't see any blood on the ground, so that's not a good sign. Alright, moment of truth. 
Oh, wow. Double lung and heart at 137 yards. So I spawned back at my outpost because I wanted to head south and I did back up the time because it was coming near the end. Now just coming along and I do have a level 4 coming in. Alright, he's in range. Hopefully I didn't make a bad shot on the second. First shot should have been solid. And here he is piled up. Okay, so the first shot got the right lung, liver, stomach, and intestines. And then second shot was just a flesh. So I was getting a couple of warning calls. I do have a level 3 bull. I did send out a few calls. He's definitely in range. Right to the heart. So, got a double lung and heart at 71 yards. So yet again I've been sending out a few calls, do have a bull coming in, alright 70 yards out, well, he's still coming in so let's range in for 54, he was about to get alert or I think he was alert, that's definitely going to take him down. Now the 44 is actually a really good caliber to use. It's just the fact that I don't use the handguns that often, so I can't wait till Tuesday for the 44 lever action to be available. But for this guy, the first shot got the right lung, liver, stomach, and intestines, so I definitely destroyed him. He was 46 yards out, and then the second shot got him in the pelvis. So this level 4, I did manage to spook off before because he picked up my scent. Now every time I send out a call, he just kind of runs around in that area. He doesn't go further out. He doesn't come any closer. As long as he doesn't realize I'm here, he's he's been nervous the whole, whole time. I can get within 120 yards, which I think he's just about there. Let's try another call. See what he does. Oh no, get the gun. Hopefully that was solid. Try to get a spot on him here. Oh no. He was heading in that direction. I'm definitely going to have to check it out. And that's what I like to see. Actually this is what you want to see on the ground. When you do pull off a shot. Now if I can remember, oh there he is. So like I said before, the 44 is actually a pretty good caliber to use. So I busted through this shoulder blade, got the right lung and liver at 116 yards. Another herd of caribou, there's level 4. That's a level three. Those are females. Oh, there's a four coming right at me. I don't know what happened on that first shot. 
but he didn't react. And I'm not too sure if I actually hit the ground. That's why I just had to take a sec second shot higher. And I did pull off a vital shot, so he definitely went down, and he didn't run very far. Uh, double lung and liver at 35 yards. I just got eyes on another level 3. Now I did send out a few calls. Let's get him in closer. You're not 160 out, that's for sure. You're about 120-ish. If he keeps on not heading, he is working his way to me. He's about 100 yards. And another heart shot, and let's go grab him quickly before he decides to float away. Hopefully the water is shallow enough here. Oh, that looks a little deep. Got the heart and right long at 73 yards. Got another caribou, he's about 120 out, he just got alert, my wind's blown directly towards him. Let's see if he turns back around, or give me that broadside. His health is dropping, I definitely got him. Should pile up right about there somewhere. Now I'm going to have to work my way over there, there is a bridge to cross over. And here he is piled up. Uh, got a double lung at 130 yards. And the bullet actually centered pretty nicely. I'd say that's a pretty good shot. Well folks, on that note, uh, that's going to be a wrap for the clip. So hopefully you all enjoyed me coming out on Yukon Valley and taking down some caribou. I definitely had some fun, although I do have some there. Maybe take down one more if there's a bowl. I did have eyes on a bowl. Where's the bowl? Oh, there he is. Oh, he's, oh, he's about to flee. All right, well, scratch that. <laughs> so, like I said, I appreciate you guys all watching my clips. Hold on a second. I'm uh, turning this outro backwards here. So let's kind of repeat, which I don't like doing. Alright folks, that's going to be a wrap. For those that watch my videos, I really appreciate it. <laughs> like and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys all next time.